okay now in this one let's add a ring the rubber around here going around the whole shoe so for this one i figured you can actually use uh, a spline so if you come under spline and then you select bezier and then you come under two and then let's select the bezier here so oh. so if we go in edit mode for the spline let's go under two if you go under surface here uh, what happens is if you draw here uh, say you get okay let's just delete uh, what's here so we are in edit mode and then we we'll delete the spline that is here so just select or push a on the keyboard and then delete so vertices so if you get this here the draw if i draw notice if i draw anywhere on top here it will actually stick to the surface let me just turn off this and so here's another thing that you need to change just come down here let's change the depth let's change this to something like 0 0.02 That's okay with me, or you can even go 0 0.01, depending on what you think looks good. I think 0 0.25, 0 0.025, that's too much. 0 0.0, okay. So, notice what happens. Let me just delete this again. So, delete all vertices. So, look, if I draw on top it will stick to the surface right here so it doesn't matter where i draw so let's just remove that say if i draw here notice what has happened here is that it actually goes in then comes out resolution preview i think let's change this to like 25 so if i delete these vertices here let's try yeah so we have more geometry so for this one i will use a tab i'll use a tablet i have a wacom tab that i will use so you can you're welcome to use a mouse though for more precision i think using a tab is better for me Now that we are done with that, we can actually select this and then now let's go to the top view and notice you can actually edit these. So you can select this and just like any other vertice, you can actually uh, manipulate it. You can push the move tool, you can move it the way you want so that it fits properly. So let me, I'll, I'll try going around, just putting them properly in there are some spaces, then some places where I've actually missed. Oh. Select this point, let's just move it up. This one, let's move it in. Let's just pull this one out. Then for these parts where for these parts where you need to join these, you can just select two points and then push F to fill. So like here I have too many points, I can just delete this vertice and fix this one here. Okay, let's move this one out.
All right, so catch me in the next video where we add the shoelaces.